uh, Karen Michelle, and I'm based in Los Angeles. Those things was that I wanted to actually book television, even though I am still non-union. I believe I can make that transition, and so you know, a course popping up saying book more TV, and it's like I want to book TV, so let's take this. Um, and then one of the areas I knew I was struggling in because I really truly hated self tapes. I mean, I think I maybe got into a pseudo neutral position on them, but I still. If, if left to my own devices, I was still going to my guy. And I just said, I live in Long Beach. He's in Santa Monica. And I was still willing to roll up there to do a self tape with him. Cause I was like, I, I don't feel comfortable with this. I, it's something horrible I have to do, but yeah. I think one of the things that I knew, but you helped us really walk through that is mindset. Um, because if you don't have a good mindset, a lot of this is just sadly gonna go to waste. And then you also just gave very practical, like, okay, you need to, like, my blue screen, like, you need to get something. Because I was still, sadly, functioning in the world with the sheet, and I was trying to iron that sheet, and I was getting tired of ironing that sheet. And so it was like, no, this, this pop-up background thing is great. And then um, today, actually, I or yesterday, I actually finally got the stand for it, so it's like, oh. Hallelujah. So, anyway, so you know, I don't have to worry about background anymore. Um, and so, yeah, but just the practical tips you gave with regard to self tape, and also for me, the takeaway, another great takeaway was just doing the character breakdown because I think my panic is often always the words, the words. Well, I know the words, and I know no one gives you any type of medal for knowing the words, but I also feel that if you don't know the words. I mean, you can't be that extreme, but there's so much of the other work that I actually like doing. Like I like doing research and I like thinking about, okay, what are the thoughts the character would have? Like what, um, what is the doing research on the show as you advise? Because most of the shows I was familiar with, but there are a few that it's just like, I have no idea. So, you know, even looking at the short trailer, seeing the color palette, just all those little things, I think really do help bring your A game to something where, even though I thought I might have been bringing an A game, um, I was not. I would describe Christine as she's an encourager, um, which for me, I really liked. Like the kind of, I'll, you know, break you down, or I, I've never liked that style with regard to teaching, but she's just, she's an encourager, but she's also very passionate about what she does. So. You know, when she sees us messing up, like she showed us this example of a person who really thought they nailed something and they had this background in their self tape that was just like, <gasps> and you were like, no, you, you, you couldn't have nailed it with that because everyone's gonna be distracted by that horrible background that you have. So she's just very passionate about making sure people don't make the mistakes that she made, especially when she was like new in the industry and no one would tell her the mistakes that she made because what one of the things that I really love about her approach to teaching is that she's basically being the coach that she always wanted and that didn't have in the beginning of her journey. And I just really appreciate that because while I'm not at the beginning and beginning of my journey, I knew there were things missing. And I just feel that the information that she gave me, um, the encouragement that she gave me, it, I will definitely I know I'm going to book soon. I just feel confident about that in ways that I did not in the past. Other classes that I've taken, I think often walk you, they'll walk you through things, they'll present information. One of the things I really enjoyed about Book More TV was um, our casting exercise. That was just, it was interesting. Maybe people didn't always say some of the things you wanted, but it was good. It was good to know to get that feedback. And then I just also really appreciated um, one of our last assignments was doing a self tape and uh, Christine took the time to watch all of ours and give us feedback and for me I know I had a win because on I sent two and on the second one she just laughed throughout the whole thing so I was like yes <laughs> I am yes so again that just gave me confidence but it like I don't think in other courses that I've taken that type of exercise was available with that type of feedback with, with the coach or whomever. Um, and so that to me was just, you know, 
she already gave you a lot of information and there are certain things that I, I'm going to go back and revisit. Um, so because she, like, I definitely felt that the information that she provided was definitely worth the cost of this. If you have never worked with her, I had never worked with her before either. I saw her on um, a Dwan Johnson, um, I think it was one of his summits and I just really liked her energy. So I was just like, well, let's try it. You know, it's, it's a new year, let's try new things. And it has been worth every penny that I invested in it. I would highly encourage people to do it. For the actor that is on the fence, I understand because I know in the very, in the very beginning of the year, I was just kind of like, you know, classes, should I join new classes? But the information that Christine presented and what she said, even in her um, the introduction pitch, there was enough that she said that I knew based on some of the things she said, such as like really, it's imperative that you become comfortable with self tapes. And, you know, especially in our moment now, unfortunately with COVID, that has been, that's it been become even more true. Um, but also some of the things that she talked about with regard to just knowing how to approach a script time and time again so you can get that process down. So you know wherever you are, wh whenever you get something, you can go through this, you know the steps to go through, you know how to calm yourself, you know how to break down the script in the ways that you do, you know how to do the research, and you can break that down for whatever time frame that you have. So if you have you know, a day where you can go through and do research, but um, yeah. So if you're if you're on the fence, and as I as I said, I know I was skeptical because you know a lot of people do a lot of stuff. But um, in listening to her initial pitch, the the aspects that she covered that I knew resonated within me about self tape and then being able to go through a procedure that you know 100% is going to work for you every time because that's for me as an actress that's what I knew I was missing and so I was just like well let's let's do this and as I said earlier it has been worth every penny of my investment I would highly encourage you to do so because I really think it's it's a game changer and I'm looking forward to like not only being a testimony um, in the moment now, but being able to be a testimony with my credits, like, yes, I did this, this, and this. <laughs>